Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Shaiju Raju. In this YouTube channel, I am uploading videos in four parts. In first part, I am going to upload videos related to the subject of computer engineering. Uh, and second part, I am going to upload subjects related to information technology. Third part, I am going to upload videos related to some computer tips and tricks. And in fourth part, I am going to upload some videos related to ethical hacking. This is my third video. In first and second video, I shown you, I had shown you how to do encryption using Caesar cipher technique. And in second video, I shown you how to do using uh, how to do encryption using one on cipher. Now this is the third video in which I am going to show you how to do encryption using Wikimedia cipher. using Wigilia cipher method. Now in this video, I am going to show you how to do encryption using Wigilia cipher method. To solve the example using Wigilia cipher method, you need to take the help of Wigilia table or is also called Wigilia tabulae. So we draw the Wigilia table first then we will see the method how to do encryption and decryption using this method. Now, what you have to do in your examination, this is your page. Okay. On the left side of the margin and this is the top of the margin. What you have to do? You have to start writing from A, then B, C, D. In a similar manner, you have to write up to Z. I am not writing up to Z right now. I am leaving. I am leaving this task upon you. When you solve the example, you write up to Z and make the table like this. What I am doing in this video, I am making the table up to D only for explanation purpose. In examination, you have to make up to Z. Now the next part what you have to do, above margin you have to start from A up to Z and the left side of the margin you have to again start from A, B, C and D. Again you have to write up to Z here. In this example, I am not writing, I am leaving upon you to solve this and make this entire table and let me know if you face any problem. Now this is the part you have written first. Now to again start with here from A. A, B, C, D. In second row, you have to start from B. Remember, whatever alphabet here, you have to start from here. B, C, D, E. Again, here it is C. C, D, E, F. Again, here is D. D, E, F, G. When you solve the example after studying this, when you solve the example after studying this technique, what you have to make? You have to make the entire table. That means uh, next will be E, starting with E, F, G, H, I, like that. Okay? For this example, I am making only A to D table. Column wise and row wise. Now let's solve the example using this method Wigenier cipher. Now let's see how to solve the example using this Wigenier cipher with the help of this Wigenier table. Suppose we are having plain text equal to CAD C A D and key equal to add A double D. Remember, students, if the length of the key is less than plain text, you cannot solve this example. So you have to make the length of the key similar to the plain text. Suppose in exam the key is AD. Now here there are two alphabets, here there are three alphabets. You cannot solve this example. So what you have to do? A and D. Now only one letter is remaining. So repeat this key again. That is A. I am not writing D again because there are only three uh, alphabets. Suppose an example it is C D M. Then what you have to do? A D and A and again D. A D A D will be your key. 
I hope you understood that. The thing is, you have to make the length of the key and plain text same. And to make the length same, you have to repeat the alphabets of the key again. Here, the length of the key and plain text is similar. That is A double D and here C A D. Now let's see. Let uh, find the cipher text of the plain text C first. What we have to do? The plain text letter that is plain text alphabet C. You have to see here. That means actually this is a plain text. This portion is a plain text, and the above portion here it is key. Okay. Now remember here. Be very careful. while following this because students make mistake in the examination find c here plain text is first letter is c we are going to find the cipher text with the help of the key and plain text c so here is a c okay now fix this row this row is fixed now okay your answer will be one of this alphabets that is sure now we have to fix the column to fix the column you have to see key key is a so see there is a here it is a so now we are fixing the column so this column is fixed your answer is when where the column and row and column intersect that is your answer so here it is they are intersecting on c okay so cipher text for c and c is c itself using the key a now the cipher text for a is as i told you before you have to see a here so using plain text we fix the row so it is a first first row only a is in first row so answer will be either a b c or d that is fixed now to see to fix the column we are seeing the key that is d so now see where it is d here a b c d here it is the d so we are fixing the column so answer is where your row and column intersects that is d so answer is d similarly for d and d here make fix d and here d that is g so answer for the plain text c a d using Key A D D is C D G. So this is how the encryption process of encryption process is done using Virginia cipher method. Now let's see how we do the decryption process. In decryption process, we are having key and we are having cipher text. In decryption process, what we are having, we are having key and we are having cipher text so in the decryption process is bit different let's see how to do decryption now in decryption we want to get this plain text c a d from the cipher text c d g see how it is done cipher text first letter is c we are solving letter alphabet wise letter wise there are three letters in this there are three alphabets so we will take first alphabet first that is c now what you have to do cipher text you have to keep as it is for the time being you have to see the key now key is a d d okay so first letter of the key is a so what you have to do look here now this is key now what is this this is key portion in decryption part decryption but this key you have to look a here where is a this is your a key a so a now this row is fixed answer will be from this row only either a either b either c or d now you have to uh, get only one answer no so we have to fix the column now what we will do we will not fix the column here we will do some another method c where is cipher text c in this table okay so in this a this row is fixed so we have to find in this row where we are getting c here it is not c it is not c. it is the c 
so the answer is top of that column that is c so plain text is equal to c and you know we are having plain text c okay so your answer is right now for d what do you to do again for the same procedure see the key here d is here so answer is out of this d e f g we want only one answer so now what you have to see key is d so this row is fixed now see the cipher text cipher is also d so what you have to do you have to see in this row where d appears because your cipher text is d so first letter is d so the answer is the top of that column that is a c a we are right again c a in the similar manner when you go for g and d we will get answer d so this is a decryption process i hope this method is clear to you if you are having any doubt let me know comment below this video so i can solve your doubts as a practice part i am giving you one plain text try to solve this and comment the answer below so that i will come to know that you have understood this topic plain text is your plain text which we have taken before hello now when you go with this hello plain text and suppose that suppose key is cad now you have to remember here here only three letters in the key we have to make five letters while solving so i am uh, giving you a hint or i am actually solving this i am helping you to solve this c a d two letters are remaining so start repeating the key that is c a d again start with c a d c a now d you don't have to write because number of plain text and key are same here so now i am leaving the rest of the part encryption decryption on you to solve it and tell me what is a cipher text by commenting below on this video for solving this example you cannot make only this table you have to make the entire table try to make the entire table and try to solve it i am sure you will be able to easily solve it if you have followed my instruction in this video thank you very much students see you in next video hope you will do well in your examination thank you